Tinumbu Tenders Labour Party membership register to prove Peter Obi is not party member. Hmm. <laughs> Peter Obi is not party member. I think uh, there was a time they said this that as at the time he he contested or as at the time he joined a Labour Party, um, it was almost a uh, out of a I next a and a, um I would like maybe conditions or whatever. So they want to use that to disqualify Peter Obi. So the register was what is it called the registers register was standard and i could see i remember then when everybody was talking about it oh even when they they welcomed peter B, they did all manner of this thing and i think they even accused uh, the spokesperson or as well kenneth okonko but at the end of the day he didn't have anything you know this is the time for them to have their own defense so they are putting up everything possible just to do the same thing of course which a uh, labor party and pdp they have been against a bola tenobus this and that so this is time for them to say okay we have a lot of things against you and that's what they say you know what the place where massive rigging really occurred was in the south east then if he's not a member of labor party i next will explain that will be represented labor party in the last election so this is false i beg my request be say as this defense and attack the shell for Court, I beg lift the subsidy first because it be like say Tidumbu no serious. APC plan failed the day court rejected their impostor a uh, papa. Yes, so one thing again is that an honest question to answer whether or not because the electoral commission cannot allow anybody who does not belong to a party to contest against registered members. You know, uh, in all of this is a uh, Labour Party or INEC will be feigning ignorance because when you talk about uh, the qualification of a candidate, they will tell you it is not in their place to go and verify whether somebody's a certificate or a document or um, credentials are fake or not. Their one is just to accept if you say you have the qualification and there's something to back it up, whether it is fake or not, it is not uh, their. When they want to do their job, they will not tell you that it is not their. It is not in their jurisdiction to do that. Ah, okay. Oh. Mm. Like they always say, wonder shall never end. <laughs> um, okay. Oh. Uh, APC will be blind to Supreme Court give their judgment. Abuja and Lagos will win. But uh, he participated in the primary election, right? Yeah, he did. He participated in the election, in the primary. Well, of course, it's, that is, that is it. Yes, oh. he participated. So what is their problem uh, maybe they have a some hidden things you know most of the time they don't want to say anything it is when they go to they will not be looking for loopholes here and there so what they are doing is it's, it's normal after all apc pdp or labor party they have done their own so it is the time for labor party to or what is it called apc to bring their own defense that is it <laughs> how could you score a winning goal when you are not a member or a team that is another question being brought forward here he resigned truly from pdp but labor party has submitted his register to INEC before he joined i think uh, when a papa and a uh, arabambi came out and they were talking here and there all manner of things some people say but you were part of the you were in the party and you didn't say anything concerning that because you would have objected that i you know this man cannot be uh i can't be our representative but i just believe that uh, all this is uh, just to let them feed feed us with something hmm. they are feeding us with something 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 that is very very interesting very very interesting one thing is that uh, it's laughable it is quite clear that uh, peter will be is just another administrator who probably meant well for this country but never a politician with the way things are going if his opponent decide to deal with him there are so many loopholes which make that easy for them one of them is basically the platform through which he content contested the process that got him to the party as well as how he eventually got the party's register a uh, presidential ticket is enough case to last for the whole tenor of this current administration 
Tinubu has done this before and will be won the case. Is this how Tinubu will defend himself? He better arrange dollars for those judges handling the case. Supreme Court has ruled on that on that Tinubu is not a member of the Labour Party, so should not me do in an internal affairs of the Labour Party. OB is ahead for re. A papa was positioned by them. Supreme Court has taken care of that. That's one they have dealt with since last year. He is not serious. Next tendering. He proved that Etinobu sent a papa to disorganize the Labour Party. How can an APC member know or determine who is a member of another party? Who gave APC the Labour Party membership register? That's another thing. If OB is not a member of a Labour Party, why didn't INEC disqualify him during the pre presidential primary elections in the party? Like I said, these people are always a feigning ignorance. Of course, they are always feigning ignorance. Uh, of course, yeah, the other thing is, I'm not even surprised because that is what they are supposed to do. Uh, you tackle me, I tackle you. You dagger me, I dagger you. So, do me, I do you. Like they always say, God know the vessel. God know the vessel at all, at all, at all, at all, at all, at all. So guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this.